canned soup. Chicken noodle and beef barley soup already have a balanced ratio of proteins, carbohydrates, and fats built within each can. If you wanted to have a 100 calorie snack, you would have half a can or one cup. And if you wanted to have a 200 calorie snack, you would have the whole can or two cups. If you're gluten free, instead of the chicken noodle, I would have chicken and rice. And a mainstream drone dietitian might be looking at this and saying, it's got a lot of sodium. But we're not really concerned about sodium because you're not going to be eating processed foods for every meal. If you're in a rush and you want to have a canned soup as a snack, go ahead because your body handles salt differently when you stabilize your carbohydrates. When your insulin is low, your kidneys get rid of your salt. And since water follows salt, water will leave your body. On the other hand, I'll tell you exactly why conventional dietitians hate salt. Because conventional dietitians give you a high carbohydrate, low fat diet, which causes you to hold on to salt. In that case, you have to watch out for salt if you follow their stupid dumb diet. On the other hand, if you follow my core diet system, a diet that stabilizes your carbohydrate and insulin levels, your body will naturally get rid of your excess salt, so you will not retain water on my diet. You will, however, retain water on a standard traditional dietitian socialist diet if you have salt because their diet is high in carbohydrates. So choose your diet wisely.